that we could open to God as we love one another. Other translation of verse 10. In William's version, he says, so that you may always approve better things. In Knox Bible, this verse 10 was translated this way. That you may learn to prize what is of value. In Williams, it says, better things. In Knox version, it says, what is of value? And then in NIV version, he says, discern what is best. New Living Translation says, For I want you to understand what really matters. This is what all of us today need to know. When we talk about priorities, we are talking about the value. The best thing. The things that really matter. What we ascribe to things in relationship to the other things in our lives. God wants us to value what is most valuable. He wants us to value what He values. Priorities represent the order of things on which you spend your resources. Your time, your energy, and your money. This is what God wants us to understand. What He values is what we suppose to value. Spending your time, your energy, your money, is it for God's kingdom? Or is it for your own self-interest. Because God wants all of us to know what He values. If you want to find out what is important to you, all you got to do is just to check your checking your check stamp and see what you value the most because the Bible says where your treasure is there your heart will be also so what you value the most is what your heart dictates Do we value the works of God? Do we value those missionaries outside this country? Do we value the things like this church? Do we value our family? Do we value things? You know, all you have to check is your checkbook. Because that checkbook will tell you where your heart belongs. I always check myself when it comes to giving because I believe 
when you prioritize God, you will be blessed. Like the pastor that we visited last Saturday, they prioritize God. They give what they have to the Lord. Their savings, everything. We give our savings to the Lord. That's why you won't be surprised if the Lord will bless me. Because I prioritize the Lord. Do we prioritize God? We all operate with a set of values or priorities. Some of our priorities are godly. Some are selfish. These priorities govern most of the choices that we make in life. Priorities govern most of the choices that we make in life. Our priorities are often constructed on the basis of the relationship of the various aspects of our life. Our life consists of several aspects including our spiritual life. This deals with our relationship to God. His spiritual life deals with our relationship to God. Family, relationship, family life. This deals with our relationship to our immediate and extended family. All of this aspect it's something that we have to know. Our church life. Do we prioritize our church life? This deals with our relationship <laughs> to the local church and the people of God. Ministry life. This deals with our relationship to our ministry in the body of Christ. There's what we call vocational life. This deals with our relationship to our career and our work life. Social life, this deals with our relationship to friends. Personal life, this deals with our personal pursuit of happiness, hobbies, and whatever things that we want in our life. All of these aspects, listen to this, of our life are competing for the same resources, time, energy, and money. Everything needs energy. Everything needs your time. Quality time. 